Curious what my average day like is in Denver? Well, you're about to find out. Now doing the show live from Vegas, sportsinsiderradio.com, doing it with John, Mike. I do this every Wednesday. This is another part of my week, doing this. Don't miss that show. Now I'm over here adding to plays it to overnights that got either better or are still the same. 3,000 max over here, over here at Circa. Sharp that will take my action. I'm just monitoring things in the islands. This is what I do when I wake up. Got my Red Bull. I'm monitoring things offshore and in the States. Red Bull. <laughs> I'm getting that workout in over here. Gotta to try to keep myself somewhat fit. Mind right, body right, fix right. It's the way I feel, guys. It's how I live my life. All right, guys, now I'm over here doing a settle up. I got 170 coming. Uh, he gave me 100 cash. No ones. Yeah, guys, just moving money around this time of year. We got March Madness coming. Whew, busy times. Everything feels so rushed. One thing I always say too, guys, try to detach yourself emotionally from what's going on when you're betting. If you've won five in a row, try not to get too excited. Lost five in a row, don't be too down on yourself. This is important. Mistakes happen when you get too emotional either way. You don't want to be overconfident. You don't want to feel worthless or it gets you out of your game. All right, going strong. Been betting for a few hours and I got Overnight college hoops I need to do. I need to get those out for clients. And then we will recap what, what happened at the end of the day. All right, just finished. Uh, the big loser in NBA today was Portland. Um, in college, the big loser was NC State. Other than that though, cleared two and a half units. Did really well. UMass covered for us. That was the big one in college. Uh, the big one in pro was Charlotte, so. Feels good, and uh, yeah, keep following me. More tips, I'll be releasing tips, uh, taking on some questions as well. Guys, have a nice night.